Hello everyone, this is Lolo the Samurai. Welcome back to more Rwanda League from the Academy of Football Manager 2020. We got a big episode today. We got we got a good draw. Um let me just drink quickly. We got a good draw to, uh, today. Uh we are playing Alkino Omberman the second round. The first round we actually beat Racing Club of Niger. So yeah, we beat Racing Club of Niger. Not really convincing though. We only won 3 0 and those type of games we should be winning 7 0, really. But yeah. That that's how uh, that's how we did it, and um, you know, Alkin and Underman, they're not a bad side. Uh, Sudan's league, the Sudan's top clubs are not too bad, but I can't see them being any harder than Almerik or Underman, who we beat twice last year. So I think this is a very favorable draw. I wasn't originally gonna show this game, but I decided we haven't cracked the Champions League group stage code yet, so uh, I gotta show all the second rounds until we finally do so. So as repetitive as this can be. We need to, um, we still need to show these games. So, yeah. Um, just gonna do a quick pick. Let's see what the assistant thinks. Uh, I, I agree with that, I think. Um, John Clausen subs, perhaps. We don't want too many forwards. And then Dolly on the, on the right. Because, um, yeah, his, he's still training there. He's still got the physicals. He's got decent pace. I thought he was gonna lose his physicals, but he still has some of them. So, we'll play him on the right. And that's gonna be our lineup. So let's do this. Um, as for last intake... It wasn't really that great. Um, I don't. Uh, we got this guy, Ross Ross Manzi, who was he's he's nothing we haven't seen before. Like we got no like so much for that great midfielder we were supposed to have. We got none. Like we got one midfielder who is nothing we haven't seen before. So game literally tricked me. But yeah, we're gonna play with this team. Okay, the other man, let's do this. Okay, let's see who they have. They're mostly great up players, but. Yeah, they're not a they're not a bad team at all. They have uh, we can't underestimate them, but they're certainly easier than the last two draws we have we have had. So yeah, that's what we're going with. Always, mm, always close down. I hope we win this, really. And uh, I reckon since you know what our midfield is so bad that we're going to just uh, play direct. All right, kick off. Let's do this. This is the. I'm hoping the next generation of players for the Rondo Lake from the Academy start spawning soon. Because I, I feel like we've reached our quota for the last few years. Like, 10 years ago, we had the light, beautiful too. We had players like um, uh, Melinda. This this time around, we have Terry Simba, Mariposa 4, Big Patrick 2, Inostros, and Barori. And our keeper is starting to really hit uh, good heights as well. Like, he's uh, it's still nowhere near as good as Washington, but... He's got better one on ones. He's got um, he's got good reflexes. That the only real weakness he has is he can't play with his feet. But other than that, we have distributing short anyways. Yeah, I'm actually drinking something different today. I'm actually drinking um some. I usually drink soda or water, but it's not. I'm actually drinking tea. I'm trying to make. I've been told it helps the dry throats, so I'm trying that. Um, let's take some of the family's advice. So yeah, I'm, I'm just I'm drinking tea today. <laughs> this is completely different to what I usually drink, but yeah, in the videos. And we are not doing anything. It's the same story as always. We just can't score. Doesn't help that we can't uh, see the great out players. Yeah, I, I can't see these guys. He's a defender playing at a right back. Might want to attack there in the second half. I think I will actually. Just play on the left. Cause yeah, nothing is happening. It's another very, it's another big stalemate. Good thing the board doesn't want to entertain you football, otherwise I would have been sacked by now. But yeah, um, you can go out there and play without pressure. Ah, oh, didn't work. All right, we're gonna. Can we have faith in them? Alright, what, what can we do here? Here's a chance. Alright, we have it. Alright, get it out. Simba, Mariposa 4. That was close. We almost lost it there. We almost lost it there again. Karangwa, Perori on the, on the right. Perori making his mark. Running up. There's a cross. Alright, goes, finds his way to Umunjeri. Umunjeri crosses it in. Moscow. Moscow fans win in the middle. He scores from outside the box. Come on. 
the first goal of the match, Moscow. Great finish. Great strike. What's this long shot at? Oh, I gotta, I can't check right now. There's not a chance. Inostrosa goes way wide. Wasn't even that close. I don't know what the commentary is saying. His long shot is five, and he scores them all the bloody time. So the match engine is so messed up. <laughs> but then again, he probably doesn't miss like one out of six long shots. Which I guess it's not. I don't know if that's a lot, but we got a lot of shots that are not on target. So I, I, you know, I might want to think that they score for they shoot from like halfway of the pitch. All right, we could score one more. That'd be good. Um, clearly, it's having mana chance. And is not done too badly, but we gotta play the. We gotta see if it's having mana can make a uh, can make a change here. I'm not too comfortable with one nil. I know we can win the Sudan, but still not too comfortable. Still not that comfortable because we won last year one 0 against Vita Club. And then we lost 3-1 in the away leg. So this game can throw, can pull any punches that you're not expecting at you. Sabimana, okay. Barori crosses it in, goes straight to El Tahir, the keeper. What's he going to do here? Okay, that was, looks like he can't play with his feet. But we have it back and uh, we head it straight to them. Ahmed. Okay, good Moscow. Moscow has been a part of the match here. Umun Jerry. Cross it in. There's Nsabimana. There's Simba. What a goal. Didn't actually try a shot at goal on Sabimana. He just passes straight to Simba. It was open. And we were 2-0 up against Alkila Omdurman. Not bad. Not bad at all. Okay. We are 2-0 up. And they're going more attacking. That that could potentially be good for us. Cause yeah, because they know 2 0 doesn't come for them. Alright, um unless it's a late chance, unless we're gonna win 2 0. And that we do. Uh comfortable lead to take it to the second leg. So that's awesome. We are on um, very close to our championship group stage. Um, so who else could we potentially be dealing with? Okay, Stan Marlins is there for sure. Orlando Pirates more likely. With that, more likely. Alger, not completely there yet. And uh, I think Asik's going to go there because Asik was the champion of the last uh, Champions League. Stan Marlins not one we've actually faced before. You'd think that they won't be very good because they're from Mali, but they're actually very powerful. They gave me a lot of trouble in my last save. So, yeah, I'll see you on the second leg. All right, we are back for the second leg. Um, I'm gonna go with the same lineup, I reckon. Match preview. Uh, they're actually favorites for this, which is no surprise. Uh, they're still they they're still a more reputable club, so more 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 is to be expected of them. So yeah, um, let's submit team. We're gonna go with the same lineup. Um, I do want to show the message again. Sometimes the instant result button doesn't show up, and I don't want that. All right, dressing room. There's the instructions. Uh, we're gonna you know what? We'll just do it the short way. I don't want to take forever. Marking these lads. All right. They're expected to get a result. So let's do this. <laughs> Even though I'm fully expecting us to get a result here. All right. Ali. Get it out, Simba. Okay, let's give another chance here. Early chance for Ahala could be the worst thing that we have right now. But we have the ball. Mariposa 4 runs up the right flank. Keeps going. But Mariposa Ma crosses it in. Or doesn't cross it in. And he crosses it in. Ooh, Jerry Simba. That was another good play from us. Is the chance over? Uh, doesn't seem so. And Dolly. And there it is. There it is. He scores. And Dolly scores. First goal since we're turning from injury, if I recall correctly. At least in the Champions League, anyways. Good goal. That's what we're having him out right. That's what we have him out right. Alright. So they need four now. We look 
well on our way to Champions League group stages. I'm not ruling anything out, but um, these aren't South Africans, so I think uh, honestly we'll be fine. I honestly think we'll be okay here. Right. And uh, Kaiser Chiefs is on their way to the group stage as well. That doesn't comfort me very much. Kaiser Chiefs have not been that dominant on this save, which really surprises me on uh, my Lesotho save. And another friend who did a Swaziland save, Kaiser Chiefs was way above anyone else. And that's not a penalty. Yeah, Kaiser Chiefs won every single every single uh, tournament. And this save, they've been kind of pathetic, if you ask me. Sundowns have been the powerhouses on this. Okay, yeah, no penalty. That's the correct decision. Shouldn't even have been looked at. It was a completely clean tackle. FM to me hasn't grasped uh, VAR yet, to be honest. But it doesn't bother me as much here as it does in real life. Like, it's just a feature that needed to be on, on the game. Just because it's in real life. For realism's uh, sake. Alright, so beating uh Ahala 1 0. We need um actually we don't need any goals. They need four. They need four goals. Okay, it's another chance. Barori, Mariposa four. It's Barori again, he's gonna cross it in. Is he gonna cross it in? He puts it in the box and Dolly back to Barori. And there's a good little touching play. We're playing so well here. I'm generally surprised at how uh, fluid the attack has looked. Canberra. Inostrosa, Karangwa, Kasapzindoli, Nodrissin, Karangwa, he goes with the overlapping Barori. Barori gonna cross it in, there's Dolly, and there's Mariposa 4, who hits it over the bar. Very unfortunately he does, but we're looking very good here. I'm I'm actually impressed. And over these two legs, the attackers look so fluid. Which, the first half I was complaining about how, oh, not one of these games again. And they just shut me up. <laughs> and they shut me up even more here. Cayendo Bocas. Ahmed. Ah. Oh, we do not deserve that. We do not deserve that. Wali Hamad scores. To be fair, we have been wasteful anyways, but like the attack is connecting well. I'll be a bit disappointed if we don't win this on the right. But I can't ask for too much. Yeah, I cannot ask for that much. We gotta get to the group stages. It's a really important thing for me. Right, I'm gonna make a sub. I don't think it's good, uh, wise to rest my players. So I'm gonna put in. No, you know what? Should I make a sub? Let's put John Clouds on for Karangwa. Alright, here's another chance. Uh, hopefully, it's not a goal for Akhilal. If it is a goal for Akhilal, I'm really gonna start to worry. Mohamed, Ahmed, there's Hamad, uh, Ali, Hamad, Ibrahim. Oh no, we gotta tackle them. Tackle them. Oh, there's a wide open gap there. Uh, Eldin, Hamad, Ali. Oh no, they score again. Ah. <sighs> That's not good. We've really turned off the pace since um, their first goal. And now I'm really starting to worry. Demand more. It's not a chance. If this, this, they score, I'm going to the other counter just to hold the result. Moscow, there's Indoli. There we go. 2-2. Two -two. Kind of a poor performance defensively though. Without lying. I was not, we, we looked all right in attack. But defensively, we've uh, looked poorer than usual. Now, this team is better than the other Sudanese team we faced. 
Uh, not that surprising. Okay, now I'm pretty sure the big team in uh in Sudan, but Almeric uh, didn't really give us much of a much trouble. These guys are a little bit. All right, well, we're back in the Champions League group stages. We are back in the group stages. That's good. That's good stuff. And hopefully this time uh, we do make the impression, maybe even win it. Like, I don't think we'll win it, to be honest. But, I mean, it's, I, don't think it's, I don't think it's impossible either. Like, I think we uh, really have to give it a go. And, wow, we are 200K in the white. Um, the aim's got to be go professional. Before anything, all right. Um, all right, that group's not too tough. I mean, there's our luckily, and the Yimbo won it a few years ago. Uh, but other than that, nothing that really scares me too much. Okay, Kaiser Chiefs, Orlando Pirates, those are the only um South Africans. It looks like Amrik Onderman actually snuck their way into the group stages. So, yeah, we just we just beat what I think is gonna is the rivals. Let me check. Are they rivals? Yeah, okay, fierce rivals. Okay, the Onderman. So, we beat just um. I think it could be. I'm not too scared of that group. I think uh, we can definitely go through. So, yeah. Um, I don't think this time I'm going to show every Champions League group. I think I'm going to do the same order I always do. And um, do um, two, four, five, and six. That's what I think I'm going to do. So, yeah. The first game we're going to do is I likely. I likely away. Thank you for watching. This is Laura Simra, and I'm signing off. Cheers.